Hello, hello. Hello, good evening, teacher. Hello. Good evening. How are you hello. tonight? Hello. I'm fine, Very teacher. Well. And you? I'm good. Hi. Why are you guys so happy? So you're in class? I feel good. I feel good. Do you know that? Welcome, Jacqueline, Patricia. How was the weekend? Welcome. Weekend. How was the weekend, guys? Anything exciting? I'm so exciting. It was? Yes, it was. I... It was exciting. All right, awesome. Very good. Okay, we're going to continue and let's see how far we can get. All righty. So let me share with you. Yes. Right, we're going to learn. Good looking. The what? <laughs> what are you talking about? The hair? Good looking. Are you? The hair, you like it? <laughs> Look, it's a new color. Alrighty, let's start with number five. Do you know that? It would be so nice to read to read the objective. Writing uh, the same things use using modified we participate. No, hold on, hold on. Sorry, this is loading. I'm waiting for section five. We're gonna read that objective. Okay. So give me one second, hold on. Finish. Sorry? Finish. Not yet. I got disconnected. Hold on. Should be better now. 5.0 lesson objective, Jacqueline. Yes, teacher. Read objective. What number? Five, five, five. Number one. Yes. Number okay. Five. Objective in this session. Uh, five, teacher. Mm -hmm. In this session, we will learn. Okay. In this session, we will learn about present perfect. Present perfect is put in private conversation. All right, very good. Put in practice during the conversation. Very good. Let's pay close attention to the pronunciation, all right? The three. Welcome to section 10. In this lesson, we will listen and practice a conversation between two people in New Orleans. See present perfect in context. Listen and practice. It's great to see you, Todd. Have you been in New Orleans long? Just a few days. I'm really excited to be here. I can't wait to show you the city. Have you been to a jazz club yet? Yeah, I've already been to one. Oh. Well, how about a riverboat tour? Uh, I've already done that, too. Have you ridden in a streetcar? They're a lot of fun. Actually, that's how I got here today. Well, is there anything you want to do? You know, I really just want to take it easy. My feet are killing me. In context. Listen and practice. See present perfect in context. Listen and practice. Okay, first of all, before we start practicing, where can you identify present perfect, guys? Present How you perfect? being? 
Let's see, let's go one by one. No, that's not the first, oh, have you been? Yes, that is the first one in the person's perfect. Very good, next. Have you been in your Orlando? Yes. Have, have you been to a jazz club yet? Club yet, very good. What else? That's it, right? If, if really been to one, have you written? Have you written? Yes, very good. I've already. This, guys, the pronunciation of this I've, is I've. 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 I will. I've. Miguel Campos, hi. I've. I've. Welcome. Ahí los ando siguiendo. Leo, Miguel, le digo yo. Me. All right, I've. I've. What's there, by the way, and everyone. It's nice seeing you, all right? It's our last, last four classes, and nah, that's it, okay? So, let's be in class. <clears throat> Repeat after me. Questions about the vocabulary, by the way? Margarita. Yes, am I? Margarita. Hi. I have a very much work. No, oh, no, big workload. Okay, so you're here though. All right, questions about the vocabulary, guys? Um, but yeah, no, I just want to make this. No, repeat after me then. No. Okay. It's great to see you, Todd. Have you been in New Orleans long? It's great to, it's see, great you, to see you, Todd. It's great to see you. Have you been in New Orleans long? Have you been in New Orleans long? Just a few days. Just a few Just days. Just a few days. Day. 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 I'm really excited to be here. I'm really, I'm really excited, excited to be here. here. I can't wait to show you the city. I, I can't, can't wait to show you the city. To show you the city. Have you been to a jazz club yet? Have you been to a jazz club yet? Yeah, I've already been to one. Yeah, yeah. yeah. I've already, I've already, been, to already one. been to one. I've already been to one. Well, how about the riverboat tour? Oh, oh well, 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 how about the about river riverboat tour? tour? Oh, I've already done that too. Oh, oh, I already, already, already done that, that, that too. Not too. Okay, I want you to connect this. I've already look. I've all. I've all. Say. I've already. 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 Done that too. Okay. Have you ridden in a streetcar? Are you ridden in the streetcar? They're a lot of fun. They yeah, are a lot, a lot of fun. fun. Actually, that's how I got here today. Actually, Actually that's how I got here today. 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 Well, is there anything you want to do? Well, is there anything you want to do? You know, I really just want to take it easy. My feet are killing me. You know, uh, I really I just really want to really take want it easy. Take it my feet are, are killing me. are killing me. Are killing me. Killing me. I want to take it easy. Take it easy. Take it. Take it easy. 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 Take Calmado. All right, let's practice. And um, I want you to modify some of it, okay? For example, you're going to say, have you been to, you know what? We're going to do it about San Salvador, all right? Have you been to? It's great. To the cathedral. Have you been to the cathedral? How long have you been in San Salvador? Oh, one week, for example. I'm really excited and afraid now. 
<laughs> really excited. I can't wait to show you the city. Have you been to the cathedral? What's the name of the cathedral, guys? The cathedral. The three cathedral. What's what the name? Cathedral? Yeah, I've already been to it. Oh, how about the... How about a Dunco, for example? Oh, I've already... La, la, la. Okay, so I want you to practice and modify. Ready? Okay. Let's work in pairs. Here we go. Okay. okay. Oh, well, how about a rival tour? Oh, I have, I have already done that too. Have you riding in a streetcar? They are a lot of fun. Actually, that, uh, how I go here today? Well, is there anything you want to do? You, you know, I really just want to take take it take it take it easy. Take it easy. My feet are killing me. Okay. Uh, we can practice with Margarita. Okay. But, but Number, we change the topic. I am tall. Okay. You are jam. Uh, do you? Yo voy a hacer todo. Ok. But I changed the conversation. Ok. It's a great. How do you really in a tractor? A, a street car. They are a lot of fun. Actually, that's how I got here today. Well. Is there anything you want to do? You know, I really just want to take it, take it easy. My feet are killing me. Ahora modifiquémoslo. Okay. Okay. It's great to see you, Jessica. Have you been in cathedral? Um, just a few days. I am really excited to be here i can wait to show you the 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 city the capital okay have you been to uh los chorros yet <laughs> And fun. Oh, fun. Actually, 
actually, uh, that show I got here today. Well, are there anything you want to do? You know, uh, I I really just want to take it easy, my feet for killing. Okay. Do you know? Or yo. Okay. But this is the dos. So, so Leo. Like me. Okay. <laughs> okay. Uh, <laughs> me, yo. Jane? It's great yeah. to see you. So, how you been in the New Orleans loan? Just a few days. I am really excited to be here. I can't wait to show you city. You the city. Yeah, continue. How do you be to just close it? Yeah, I've been ready to be to one. Been to one. Oh, well, how about a riverboat tour? Uh, I've read that too. How do you reading an a stretcher car? They are long of mm. fun. Actually, that, that show I got today. Well, is there anything you want to do? You know, I just want to kiss it. My feet are feeling. Who's more? Who's more? Uh -huh. One more time. Okay. Okay. Patricia or? I am. Yeah. Dinora. Dinora. Uh, Patricia Dinora. Yes. Patricia now I enjoy me too. Okay. 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 No. You know? No. Um, actually, that showed I got to hear in Santana this weekend. Uh, yes. <laughs> okay. Only. <laughs> okay. Uh, we can practice um, uh, another more. Okay. Okay. If. Uh, switch the the person. Uh, you are Todd and me, Jan, right? My feet are killing me. Okay. Okay. Al revés. Al revés. It's great to see you, Todd. Have you been in your land long? Just a few days. I'm really excited to be here. I can't wait to show you the city. Have you been have you been to a jazz club yet? Yeah, I am ready to be to one. Oh well, how about a riverboat tour? Um I am ready now done that too. Are you ready in a streetcar? They are they they're a lot of fun. Actually that's how I got here today. Well, is there anything you want to do? You know, I really just want to take it easy. My feet are killing me. Uh, I mean, let's take it easy. Take, take it, it easy. easy. Uh, take oh, it calmado, easy. Calmado. Okay. Mis pies me están matando. Mm -hmm. Esa, hay que practicar bien ese, la contracción de Ivo. Ivo. I will ask you. Okay. Okay. Thank you. Alrighty. 
you practice? Yeah. How was yeah. it? Tell me at least a modified sentence that you wrote or that you practiced. Tell me something you modified. Come on, share with me. No, nothing. Did you ask, for example, have you ever been to El Tunco? Yes, I have. I went there last month. No? <laughs> <laughs> Oh, you're shy tonight. Anyway, I, I heard you practicing, so that was good. Anyway. Teacher, have you been in El Salvador long? El Salvador. Hold on. That wouldn't be an applicable question because I'm not there right now. But, like, have you been in Argentina long? Because I'm currently here. Oh, okay. Yeah. Or have you... No, you know what your question? Yes, I know, I know, teacher. Okay. Uh -huh. Have no, you been Have you been in in Argentina? No, but I want long. to help you ask the question. So, has it been a long time since you don't go to a Salvador? Maybe this is an applicable question. Has it been a long time? Okay. And I'll say yeah, it's been a year. All right, very good. Now, uh, volunteer, somebody to read the objective. Elias. Elias, are you there? Nope, I don't hear you, you're muted. Hello, teacher, hello. Hi, you ended up joining, that's good. <laughs> okay. In this section, we will study the present perfect with a ready and yet. Ask and answer questions using the present perfect with regular and irregular uh, past participle. Awesome. Let's watch the video. And this is going to explain to us how to use present perfect. All right, we almost finished. On Thursday, we're gonna have our last class. Yay, <laughs> we're almost done. So pay attention, please. Yay. Hi, in this lesson, we will study present perfect with already and yet. Ask and answer questions in present perfect with irregular and regular past participles. I want you to concentrate on these new tense. Notice how it is formed. Pay close attention to the words already and yet. Present perfect. Already, yet. The present perfect is formed with the verb have plus the past participle. Have you been to a jazz club? Yes, I've been to several. No, I haven't been to one. Has she ridden in a streetcar? Yes, she's ridden in one. No, she hasn't ridden in one. Has he called home lately? Yes, he's called twice this week. No, he hasn't called in months. Have they eaten dinner yet? Yes, they've already eaten. No, they haven't eaten yet. Contractions I've equals I have. You've equals you have. He's equals he has. She's equals she has. It's equals it has. We've equals we have. They've equals they have. They have. Haven't equals have not. Hasn't equals has not. For present perfect, we will use have or has plus past participle verb plus complement. The verb have or has will depend on the person we will talk about. We use present perfect when we want to express actions which began in the past and continue in the present. Example, she has worked in the bank for five years. We have had the same car for 10 years. 
when we went to make reference to an unfinished temporary period of time. I have worked hard this week. It has rained a lot this year. We haven't seen her today. Repeated actions in a specific period of time between the present and the past. They have seen that film six times. We have eaten all that restaurant many times. When timing is not relevant or it is unknown, someone has eaten my soup. Now let's talk about already and yet. Already usually goes after have or has and before the main verb. Examples, we have already had our breakfast. When are you going to do your homework? But I've already done it. Yet means that something that we expected has happened or hasn't happened. We usually put it at the end of a sentence. Examples, has the post arrived yet? Have you done your homework? Not yet. Haven't you got ready yet? Look at the time. The present perfect with already and yet. Ask and answer questions in present perfect with irregular and regular past participle. Present per perfect. Already. Okay. Everybody, turn the cameras on, please. I only see black screens tonight. What's going on? What is going on? All right, we're going to learn person perfect. Hey guys, we just studied person perfect in the past. Yes? Nope? Nope. Never studied person perfect? No. No, teacher. What? I don't remember. I don't understand. I don't understand. Um, Hello. So, so, teacher. Okay, move the microphone, please. And we're going to start with something simple. All right. First of all, we're going to, let me see. You're uh, supposed to have studied that before. Anyway, okay. okay. All right, usage of present perfect. Take notes, all right? Uh, we're going to use this for unfinished actions, meaning that they started in the past. They started in the past and continue to the present, all right? Also, if for non time specific events, it's our ya he llegado, has probado las minutas, all right? We have this sense in Spanish. So it's not difficult to understand when we use it, okay? All right, this is the usage. What's the structure? Write the structure on the notebook, please, because we, we're going to have to practice. So, subject plus have or has plus past participle. Okay. So, when are we going to use has? For what subjects, guys? She. Okay, we're going to use it for she. What else? He. He. It. And it. when are we going to use have? I, you, I, you we. they, we, they. Very good. Now, this is the structure. Let's make some examples together, all right? But we need to remember that the contractions are these. Look, you can see them here. The contraction of I have is I've. Repeat, I've. 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 Have. I've. You've. 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 He has. You've. His. 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 He has. His. 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 It has. It. 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 Okay, I have a question for you. So, what is the difference between he is and he has the contracted form? What is the difference? With the verb be. Is the past participle verb next? Okay, hold on. This is my question. 
on his long. This is the contraction for he is, right? And this is the contraction for he has. What is, how do we know the difference? No, they're not, it's no, not long. There's the, no difference. No difference. Is. There's no difference. No difference. The Next. Going to know because of that context. Okay. Context. Okay. That will tell you. So, alrighty. So, let's continue then. Let's make a sentence. We can do it. We're going to work, first of all, we're going to work with the, with an affirmative. I, affirmative. Affirmative statement. So we can use contractions. All right. Okay. Um, guys, let me ask you have you ever traveled to the United States? Have you ever traveled to the United States? Uh, I'm not. I don't. I haven't. I. I, I haven't. I haven't. Not. I haven't. This is a question. No, I haven't traveled. Have you no, I haven't. Traveled to the U.S. Una, un día creo que les di el tip de que uno siempre responde las preguntas cortas con la que se empieza la pregunta. Do you? Yes, I do. Are you happy? Yes, I am. Did you go? Yes, I did. Y acá sería entonces, will you study? Yes, I will. Have you? ¿Cuál sería la respuesta? Yes, I yes, have. I have. Ah, exactly. Yeah. Siempre fíjense y se responde igual. Yes, I have. Okay. Anyway, eh, who has traveled to the United States? Nobody? Okay, eh, let's make it easier. Me no, me no. Not me, not me. Not me. Okay. Have you ever traveled to Guatemala? Yes, I yes, have. Yes, I have. Yes, I have. Okay, let's make a sentence, a real one. Guatemala. Who said yes? Gabriel and who else? Yes. Me. I have. What's your name? Jackie. <laughs> Jackie, okay. Jackie. Our has, guys. Has. 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 Jackie has traveled to Guatemala. And now we're going to say... Travel it to Guatemala. Jackie and Gabriel... What is the sentence? Jackie and Gabriel... Have... 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 have traveled travel to Guatemala. To Guatemala. Is that clear? Yes. Okay. Guys, who has eaten sushi? Have you ever eaten sushi? I have it. Yes. Yes. I have. I have. Yes, I have. Carlos, Elia. No, it's delicious. Yes, I have. No, I have it. Okay, so we're going to say, for example, Carlos, help me, help me. Come on. Carlos. I hate. I hate sushi. <laughs> so Carlos hasn't. Carlos. Hasn't. No, affirmative. Has. Oh, has. 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 Sushi. Okay, pay attention. How can I contract it? Can I say is it correct? Yes. Yes, yes. It's correct. Yes, it is. Okay, who has studied English? Me teacher. Me teacher. Everybody, everybody. So everybody say, yes. We have we have studied. English. Okay. How can I make a contraction here? We've. 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 We've studied English. Yes. Very good. So that is the affirmative form. Now, let's do the negative form. All right, what's the negative form of this? We're simply going to add not, okay? Or the contraction. Jackie? Hasn't traveled to Guatemala. Jackie hasn't traveled. Travel to Guatemala. Very good. That is a negative form. Or you can also say Jackie has not. No. You can say she's she's not, not traveled. You have traveled. options to Guatemala. Okay. Is that clear? 
Yes. Now let's do Jackie and Gabriel. All right, what's the negative form? Help me. Jackie and Gabriel they, haven't. They, they, they haven't traveled to whatever. Travel to whatever. Or, or they, they, they have not traveled to, to Guatemala. Yay, very good. You've done a great job. All right, Carlos. Negative form, come on, come on. Carlos has not eaten. Carlos has not. Oh, has Carlos it. hasn't. Has not eaten. Mm -hmm. Carlos hasn't. Has or he's not he's eaten. Not not eaten. eaten. So you have three forms, okay? Let's read them. Read them with me. Carlos has not eaten. Go ahead. Carlos has Carlos not, has eaten. not, eaten. not eaten. Carlos hasn't eaten. Carlos hasn't eaten. Carlos hasn't eaten. Carlos hasn't eaten. He's, He's not eating. He's not eating. He's not eating. He's not eating. He's not Very good. All right. And then we have, we have studied English. How do we do that in the negative form? We have, we have not. We haven't. Yeah, the not, when you don't contract it, acuérdense que no se hacen contracciones en escritos. Entonces, tiene que saber manejar la no contractada también. So, we have not, that is English. All right, contracted form. We haven't. We've not. We've not. <laughs> that is English not. or, or, one more. We haven't. Haven't. We haven't. Daddy, very good. All right. Daddy. Now let's look at the questions. Look, here's one question. What is the structure for the question, guys? What? Questions with uh, present perfect. What is this? I have. So first, you're gonna say how or has have plus. Subject plus subject plus verb, verb. present the perfect. The verb in what form? Past perfect participle. Past participle. Oh, participle. Past participle. In complement. Very good. The remember, question mark. Yes. Do you remember the question, question about sushi? How did I ask that question? Yes. Have, have they eaten sushi? Has she eaten sushi? Yes, that's a good example. All right, and the answer? Have you eaten su sushi? What's the uh, answer? He has eaten. He has. Yes, yes he, he has. has. She has. has. Or she. Yes. Or no. No, she hasn't. No, she hasn't. Oh, is she right? No, she hasn't. Those are the options. Very good. Um, is that clear? So, so. So, so, another example. All right, now, subject, the subject we're going to use is Michael, all right? And we're going to ask about Michael. We're going to ask if he has, um, or Chata. Imagine that Michael. Mate. <laughs> we're gonna put Michael in. Imagine <laughs> that Michael is from Canada, all right? Vamos a preguntar. ¿Alguna vez ha tomado mate, Michael? How do you ask that question, following this structure? Have, has, 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 Michael drunk? has, Michael drink drunk? Drunk. 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 Yes, you have drink, mate. Mate. Drunk. Drunk. Mate. Drunk. Yes. Wrong, mate. 
No, mate. ¿Y qué mate? Yes, yes, he has. It's a no, herbal he tea from, from um, Argentina. It's a tea. I'm going to show you one, guys. The okay. tea de la... Yeah, it's, it's good. How do you guys know about it? This is mate, Gabriel. Okay. It's como un té. Yes, it's a herbal tea. It's like tea. Okay. <laughs> yeah, it's pretty famous here. All right. Do you drink mate, teacher? Uh, with some friends, but I don't, I don't, I don't make it myself. It's too complicated. Oh. <laughs> okay. I like it. No, se mira rico. No, it's not. But I like it. <laughs> uh -huh. Right. Very good. So you see, you can make questions. What about if the subject is you and the verb is um, go to cinema? No, not the cinema. The, Let me see. The market. Place. Another the an, zoo. An interesting Park. place. Um, the place. The zoo. An interesting place. Um, Centro histórico. Historical Center. Yeah, we're going to say... The Historical Center. Right, let's say we Okay, what's the question? Have you gone to Historical Center? Yeah, guys, but we need past participle of the verb. Go, where, has participle is? Are you going? No. Gone. Are you gone? Gone. 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 When you're gone. Gone. When you're gone. Like, yeah, there are many songs gonna. like that. No, gone. Have you ever gone? Gone. Gone. To gone. Easter. Gone. To the historical, the historical, historical center. center. Very good. And what's the answer? No, I haven't. Yes, I have. No. Yes. No, I have. No, I have. Yes, I have. No, I haven't. Uh -huh, yes, I have. Or <coughs> no, I haven't. Okay. Is that no, he haven't. Yeah, this is a little bit more complicated. I don't know why you have this topic. Yes. I, I think so. Uh, we need to practice the irregular verbs in the <laughs> past part of Yes, first of all, you need that. Okay, you know what? We're going to practice this topic. Oh my gosh, it's a lot. Are you finished? No way, this is a lot. Section five is so long. All right, yeah, I'm gonna send you a list with the verbs in the past, in the past participle so that you can use it. All right, before we do the, the final exam. So I need you to do the, let's do the exercise together. All right, hold on. Section five is so long. Give me one second. Mm -hmm. All right, let's do the exercise, okay? So let's check. Yes, number 5.4. And number one, Jessica, can you do it, please? Have you... Um, I don't know, teacher, how you... Are you done? Done. Yes, look, the verb is do, guys. Past participle is done. Take notes, all right? Do, done. How do you do? Done. Do. Yes, Ricardo. I have been. Hey, Ricardo, here you are. <laughs> Number two, Ricardo. First three. Mm -hmm. 
Come on, everybody, help me, everybody. Yes, I have been. I have been. Have you been? Yes, I have been. I have already been to aerobics class for time. Yes, the first three. Yes, nice. Very good. Number three, Patricia. Anybody, help me, anybody. Number two. Three. Read Number it. one, teacher. Yeah, subject is you. Um, have you, have you played? Number one. Have you played? Very good. Played. You played. Played. You played. Number four. Number two. Two. Read it, read it. No, I. Haven't have. Haven't have. Two or three. 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 You have. 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 Okay, that's the past participle. Had. Had. Number five. Have. Five, five, five. Five. How many movies? How many movies? How many movies? Have, have you been, been to have this month? Have have number been. two. Have number you two been? have been. How many movies have you been to this been. month? Yes. Six. I haven't Actually, seen. I haven't seen one. any yet. I haven't seen. Number one. Seven. Read it. Read the complete phrase. Have you been to any? I haven't been to any. Haven't been. Recently. Haven't been. Haven't been. Have you been? Haven't been. Okay, eight. Number one. No, I haven't gone to any. Number three. Right. Why? No, I haven't. I haven't I haven't, haven't gone, 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 gone nine. to any parties. Have you called any friends today? Has called. Mm -hmm. called. I have called. No, I you. haven't gone. Have you called any friends today? Very good. Ten. Yes, I've um, already made yes, the call. I have. Maybe. I may. <coughs> Number one. I may. Make three calls. I've made. Yes, past participle of make is made. 30 to 30. Okay. okay. We got you it. Come. You got it. Oh. All right, awesome. So let's continue practicing, all right? We kind of, let's, let's listen to this conversation. Pay attention, please. Hi everyone, a conversation will be listened to in order to practice present perfect and simple past at the same time. Notice how they use both tenses during this conversation. Listen and repeat. Listen and practice. Hi everyone. I'm sorry I'm late. Have you been here long? No, only for a few minutes. Have you chosen a restaurant yet? I can't decide. Have you ever eaten Moroccan food? No, I haven't. Is it good? It's delicious. I've had it several times. Or how about Thai food? Have you ever had green curry? Actually, I have. I lived in Thailand as a teenager. I ate it a lot there. I didn't know that. How long did you live there? I lived there for two years. Right, let's practice. First of all, where can you see the person perfect here? Listen and practice. Yes. Guys? I'm sorry. All right. Where I'm can late. you see where can you <laughs> see you present perfect? Have you been here long? 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 Oh, very good. Um, have you chosen? Have you been, have you chosen? Have you chosen? How do you ever? Have you ever eaten Moroccan food? Yes. Yeah. I have. Uh, I have. Have you ever had Moroccan food? Have you had it several times? 
Oh, I've had it. I've had it several times. I had it. I it. Very good. Okay, where can you see past simple? Past simple. Simple past? Yes. Live. Um, oh. Chosen. Chosen. Uh, let me see. Chosen. I, no, that's not past simple. simple. Simple past. Yes. Simple past. I, I live. Yet. Live. I live I in Thailand. I, live. I ate. Live. There for two years. I didn't know it's also past. I be and I live. I live. I live. Right. So we're combining I both. I didn't. It's also past. Very good. I want us to practice this conversation. This time we're not going to modify it. All right, let's practice. Ready? Let's practice in pairs with different people, hopefully. All right. One second. I'm making the groups. I mean, I'm making pairs. No, no, no. Okay. Hold on, guys. Okay, active presentation, please. Let's practice quickly. It's almost time.
You're I far think. again. Did you practice yeah. Yeah. Yes. All right, awesome. So um, we still have to study present perfect versus present simple. And um, in case you have questions, I will make them clear. All right. We still have to do the final exam. Has anybody done it? Yes. Finish the final exam? No, the exam, no, but the 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 exercise, the past exercise, yes. The last exercise. Oh, okay. Yeah, we're going to do that together, all right? So, thank you very much for joining me tonight, guys. Thank you, to teacher. Thank you, teacher. Good night. Have a good, good, night. good night, classmate. Good night, good night. Good night. Good night teacher. Thank you. Bye. Thank you.